Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Uh, today we're going to be removing lawnmower blades and talking about how you can sharpen them at your house. I'm going to be using a uh, Honda lawnmower today. And uh, before we get started, uh, any homeowner can do this, but we have to have the proper uh, tools to do this. Most homeowners already have these tools laying around our house. You're going to need a pair of safety glasses and you're going to need a 14 millimeter socket wrench in order to do this on a Honda lawnmower. So let's get started. So like I said, we need to get started here. We need to make sure we have our safety precautions. We're gonna have our safety glasses available so no debris flies in your eye. We're also gonna have a 14 millimeter socket wrench. And before we even flip the lawnmower over, we're gonna turn off the fuel, which is the switch right here. We're gonna turn the fuel off so no fuel leaks. And the next thing you wanna do is on the front of your Honda lawnmower, there's gonna be a spark plug. The spark plug, is in the front of the mower right here is a little plastic black boot and you just pull that boot off with your hands like this and you can see it's disconnected so that's the safety precautions we have to make sure the lawnmower doesn't leak fuel and it doesn't accidentally start on us while we're working underneath the lawnmower now, there's a couple different ways we can actually turn over the lawnmower to work on the blades uh, the first way that a lot of people will do is they will actually turn the lawnmower over on its side this is your air filter. You don't want to turn it on the side with the air filter. If you turn it over like this, with the side on the air filter towards the ground, fuel can leak out into the ground and, and fuel will contaminate your air filter and you could have a problem starting it. So some people, what they like to do is they actually like to turn the lawnmower over on its side to have access like that. There is another way you can actually do this. The other way you can do it is you could actually turn the lawnmower like this you can tilt it back and you can secure the handle on the back with some kind of a weight maybe push it underneath like another lawnmower you have or put some heavy cylinder blocks on it to have access to your blades underneath so you guys can have a good view here I'm going to turn the lawnmower over on its side you flip it over like this so we have two bolts on this lawnmower, one here and one here that we need to remove with this 14 millimeter uh, wrench. As you can see, the deck is really dirty. Once we remove the blades, we'll go ahead and scrape out the deck as well. So all you want to do is take this and you can either hold it with your hands, you can use gloves, or you can put a piece of wood that, that holds the blades in place as you do this. To make things easier for me, what I like to use is I have a battery powered impact wrench and you simply just put it on there, bolt comes out, second bolt, bolt comes out, and here are your blades and you can see they're somewhat dull. Now like I said, once I have this off, I can go ahead and scrape out some of this grass, keep it clean. Just use, we just use a little putty knife for that. So now that you have some of the grass removed, and you can see how dirty the deck is underneath, this lawnmower is actually used commercially. It's a five-year-old Honda uh, lawnmower. So it's been taking a lot of abuse. You can see that it's starting to rust up. It's holding up pretty well. It's a residential mower. It's being used for the commercial operation, uh, getting a lot of hours used on it. Uh, but uh, once you have your blades off and your deck uh, scraped out, uh, now you need to sharpen your blades. There's three ways you can sharpen your blade. Once you have the blades off, you can actually take it to your local dealer or some kind of a, a hardware store. Some hardware, local hardware store, stores will actually sharpen blades. Or you can take it to your local Honda dealer or any lawnmower shop and they will sharpen your blades. Uh, most of them will charge about $10 or so, anywhere from about six to $15 a blade with an average of being around $10 a blade to sharpen. Or you can do it yourself at home. Uh, you could use a bench grinder or you can use this uh, uh, grinder right here. It's a four and a half inch. Uh, on, a, on a grinder and it's a flap disc and it's 60 grit so this is what I'm going to be using today I'm going to put on my safety glasses and when you do this you just want to make sure that you line up the grinder with the same angle as the blade okay so my safety glasses are on 
we'll put the battery in it and this is how it works so that's one side i did three passes let's do the same to this side So I don't know if you could tell in the video, but that's all it takes to sharpen the first blade. And on Honda Blah mowers, we actually have two blades. So we're going to do the same thing to this side. And rotate it around. So it's easy to do at home if you have the right tools. You might not have any kind of a, uh, a bench grinder or maybe an angle grinder like I do. You just have to take it to your lawnmower shop and pay them 10 bucks to sharpen them for you. And when you get back home, uh, you just install them on your lawnmower. If you bring in a lawnmower, they're going to charge you a labor hour to actually take them off and do all this work. And most uh, lawnmower shops are going to charge you somewhere between uh, 55 to maybe $95 an hour with an average being somewhere around $75 an hour uh, just to do just to take off your blades. So take off your blades before you actually get uh, to to uh, the lawnmower shop to sharpen your blades or if you have the tools available at home you can do it yourself. So now that we have our blade sharpened to a nice point we're going to go ahead and reinstall the blades. So how you do it is you simply with a Honda like I said there are two blades you put the little blade on top of the big blade like this and they go back on the holes we're going to scroll, screw this on. Make sure you do not put the blades on upside down. This is the direction they should go. So how do you know if you have your blades upside down? You know if you have your blades upside down because you should not see the angle of your blade right now. The angle of the blade should be facing towards your lawnmower and it should be flat on the bottom. So we simply have the screws started, use the impact wrench to put them on. And that's it. Now all we have to do is tip the lawnmower back over again. We're going to take the spark, spark plug wire, put it back onto the spark plug, and we're gonna turn the fuel back on. Now, once you start doing your blades, it might be a good idea to do a full tune-up on your lawnmower. And all that means for a tune-up on the lawnmower is changing your spark plug. So once again, since we have the boot off already, when we're doing the blades, we can simply remove the spark plug, as you can see right here, here's the spark plug. And all you do is you take your wrench, you put it on the spark plug, and you turn it and turn this thing out. Once you turn it out, you put the new one in by turning to the right, putting it in, taking your wrench, and turning it and tightening it up. Put the boot back onto the spark plug till you hear it snap. You would also want to change your air, air filter. As you can see, this air filter is pretty good. So I'm going to leave this in there and you'd put a new one in like this and snap it back in. And that's all you have to do to sharpen your blades on a Honda lawnmower.